I'm Greg McQuaid. Here are the top stories we're following for you on CBS 6. Richmond police investigating an overnight shooting that killed a young girl. Police say that just before 2.30 this morning, they were called to the 2200 block of Afton Avenue for reports of a person shot. There they found a juvenile female inside the home who was pronounced dead on scene from a gunshot wound. There's no word yet on what happened or if there are any suspects. If you do have information, you're asked to call Crime Stoppers at this number, 780-1000. We have new information about another young person shot and killed in his Henrico neighborhood overnight on Saturday. Henrico school officials confirmed the 16-year-old killed on Glen Wilton Drive was a student at Highland Springs High School. We've also learned that he played on the Springer's basketball team, which less than a month ago won the state championship. Henrico supervisor Tyrone Nelson represents Highland Springs. He says the school division and county will do everything they can to wrap their arms around the young man's family and those who knew him at Highland Springs. Now here's meteorologist Mike Stone. Hi, Mike. Hey, Greg. Now from CBS 6, the Weather Authority, meteorologist Mike Stone. We had a cool start this morning with temps in the 20s and 30s and 40s. We're in this cooler part of the jet stream now. So highs today in the 50s and 60s, but everything is going to change. Tomorrow we're going to get in the 70s, and then we're going to have some 80s for Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. So a significant warm-up is coming up over the next couple days. Today, though, 50s and 60s, so pretty close to, if not a few degrees warmer than yesterday. Still another cold night ahead, but if you get past about mid-morning tomorrow. Here comes the warmth. Mid to upper 70s away from the coast, even around 80 in Danville. Going into Tuesday, high temperatures in the upper 70s and low 80s. And on Wednesday, low to mid 80s. And we should have a good enough southwesterly wind to pretty much eliminate the coastal cooling. We'll have sunshine today, a few clouds tomorrow, maybe a spotty shower on Tuesday in the morning, mostly north of Richmond, and maybe a couple in northwestern Virginia on Wednesday. But the best chance of rain for the seven-day forecast period is going to come on Thursday with a chance of some showers and thunderstorms as this cold front comes through. Behind the front, we dry out for Friday. We are tracking some rain chances for next weekend.